Those of us who have ever joined a church obviously have a pastor who was our very first pastor. Uh, when I joined uh, a special church in New Haven, Connecticut in 19, oh my, 84? 84. 84 uh, Steve Farley was my pastor. He baptized me and he was just a gentle, uh, humble soul. And I remember how ill he was. He had grown up with juvenile diabetes and he struggled and suffered. And yet he worked so very hard uh, as a pastor and uh, we truly loved uh, Steve. Um, I always appreciated him and I appreciated pastors when I became a Christian. It wasn't until I became a pastor in 1995 that I really appreciated uh, how challenging it can be, the ups and downs uh, of full-time pastoral ministry. There's so many great victories and joys in the work and there's a lot of sorrow and tears. Well, I discovered that uh, Steve had become very, very ill and had to uh, resign and, and retire from pastoral ministry. And because of insurance issues, he and his family weren't able to get uh, some much needed funding, uh, money uh, during this, this time. And so uh, several of us put together a fundraising concert in New Haven, Connecticut for Steve and his family and uh, had the privilege of singing at that concert. And I um, was inspired to write a song. I'm not sure if someone mentioned to me to do it or I just decided to do it uh, as God inspired me. And I wrote this song for Steve. I surprised him and his family that day. And we raised thousands of dollars. And I just praise God and thank God for that. Um, and Steve did pass away uh, several years ago, uh, way too young. Uh, and I can't wait to see him uh, when Jesus comes again and the resurrection takes place. Uh, so I'd like to share with you the song that I wrote for Steve, and it's simply called The Pastor. And I can't forget this. There's one line in the song that's my favorite line. You see, when Steve would visit with someone, he would always ask, how's your courage? How's your courage? And uh, I had to put that in the song, so you'll hear that uh, about two-thirds of the way in. And so, Steve Farley, in honor of him. <laughs> Take us home, my friend. He 
his angels he will send your broken body he will mend but remember until then that you're a pastor